Hey guys, this is a tutorial on how to mix two songs together in Virtual DJ. Um, so we'll go to Virtual DJ here. Um, I have these two tracks loaded up. Um, both the same BPM, which is something I recommend doing if you're just starting. Um, or, you know, around the same. I usually like plus or minus five. I don't really try to go outside of that range. Like trying to mix uh, like one of these, this 160 song with this 128 just wouldn't work. Um, unless you're doing something a little different than I'm going to be showing you guys today. Um, so we'll just cover like some basic uh, mixing um, from one track to another. So one of the easiest ways is like a lot of these uh, like electronic songs or dance songs have uh, like these long intros or outros where there's not really a lot going on and they're, they're kind of meant to be mixed out or mixed in in these parts. So we'll start with this track on the left and I'll start it around here and just act like I was playing it. Um, and I'll start mixing out right here, which is kind of the outro where all the instruments start fading out right here. And I'm going to mix in this song right here, or like right around here where it starts building up into the, into the drop right here. So I'll start it around here. Um, something I like to do is kind of match up these waveforms. And if you do it right, uh, it'll make your mixing a little bit easier because you know, what I'm going to want to do is line up these parts right here. So this is where I'm going to want to start mixing in this track. Um, because what you kind of want to do, if you're mixing uh, from the outro into the, like an intro of this song, um, is line up these parts. So this song is just going to stop playing right when the song drops. So you, you'll be mixing um, this red song into the blue one. And then it'll just stop playing for you, which kind of helps you out. Um, so I'll just demonstrate that real quick. I'll start playing it around here. So that's way, one way you can do it, which uh, is pretty easy. Just go in when one song's kind of fading out, another one's kind of fading in. It does a lot of the mixing for you because um, the instruments are fading out in this song and the instruments are kind of coming in in this one. So it's pretty easy to mix the two together. Um, uh, let's do one more way that you can you can mix songs together. Um, is kind of you can do two buildups together. Um, this definitely doesn't work for every song um, but for song some songs if you play around with them this can definitely be a way to uh, mix together which is if you mix together two build-ups so like right here the song builds up and then it drops right here the song builds up right here and, and drops right here so you can kind of mix these together um, this song kind of works because the songs like uh, mostly like highs and mids and the songs mostly mids and lows um, so they kind of they kind of mesh together without clashing too many sounds together so I'm going to start with this track on the right and act like maybe I started it just where I did it the last time I was playing through here. And then I'm going to start, I'm going to mix in, I'm going to start mixing another song in right here. And then I'm going to drop, drop it, uh, this part right here. So, um, I'll just start playing it right about here. And then I'm going to start mixing this song in right here once it gets about here on this track. So,
right, so that's another way you can do it. Um, uh, in my next video, I'll definitely be going over some different ways. There's a ton of ways you can mix songs together, but those are some uh, pretty basic ways you can do it, um, and that don't require a bunch of uh, effects or anything. You know, you can you can mix together with just just your EQ knobs um, and make it sound all right and not sound completely horrible. So if you like this video, please subscribe. I'll be making more. Um, and you can also check out my website uh, at howtomixsongs.net, which uh, I've been writing some articles for um, about basic mixing and stuff, so you can go check those out too. Uh, thanks for watching.